Well, 10 years after the September 11th terrorist attacks, the country is still mourning those who lost their lives on that tragic day. But there are heroes dying still, even today. And one family in Mesa is asking you to take a moment to also remember them. I love this picture. Yeah, that's me in the middle. When 15-year-old Jacob Hobbs was a little boy, he understood the word hero. I, I talk about like soldiers and stuff. Soldiers like his dad, Staff Sergeant Brian Hobbs. When he thinks of him, his face lights up. He was a good dad. He was very, very funny though. And when he was away doing the things that heroes do. Must be like I miss you, Dad. Hope you're doing well. But Jacob says he wasn't afraid. Why would he be? Like you're a little kid, you don't think your dad's gonna die. We actually watched that on television that morning with the Twin Towers. Linda Hobbs says her son Brian was home in Mesa on leave when terrorists attacked our country on September 11th. And then he was home. He was worried about his soldiers, all of them. He's like, uh, all they could talk about. I need to get back and take care of him. Jacob was just five years old. Like you say he's upset. Like what was his demeanor like? He was angry that this happened. Like he was ready to take, like, take action. But it wasn't until three years later that Brian was sent to Afghanistan with the 101st Airborne Division of the United States Army. And he said, oh, I'll be fine. You know, I, I won't even be in action. And I knew for a fact that he was in the middle of a lot of it. October 14th, 2004, Brian was killed instantly when a bomb exploded near his vehicle. A few days later, Linda got a knock on the door. That was it. horrible, horrible. I think, uh, excuse me, one of the worst days of my life. Yeah, you know, I just fell down, screamed. I don't really usually talk about this. We're not supposed to bury our children. When my dad told me I was supposed to be a his soldier, like his, the man of the family, I tried being, I tried helping him more, doing more chores, but I can't actually be the man of the house, it's only nine. Now, nearly seven years after his dad's death, it still hurts if you talk about it. Jacob truly understands the word hero. It's soldiers like his dad, Staff Sergeant Brian Hobbs. Even though his dad's death was devastating for his family, Jacob says he has dreams of serving in the military because soldiers are the ones who help protect the freedoms of our country.